Okay, so this morning we're going to do a little self-help on how to set up some embeds. Uh, I'm going to reset my mast up really fast. They're basically 4000 series 3M. It's great stuff. Peel the bottom. Use the tip to push it through. You got to open it up the tip. And that one just collapsed. Once you get it through, screw your tip on. Okay. So, everything in this thing, pretty self-explanatory. These are pretty easy. Oh, Note it in your cocking gun. Trim your tip. So anything you don't want this stuff on, don't let it stick to it. Keep a bottle of acetone clean close by, paper towels. Uh, it will get messy. So, keep yourself all prepped up. One of the things you want to do is wipe everything down with some acetone. Do not use denatured alcohol or rubbing alcohol. Your 4000 series will not stick. So we're going to use a little bit of acetone this morning. sure you get all your silicone old silicone or whatever was on it off uh, this mask step I actually had to re-straighten it it was actually bent and all mangled on the deck underneath the mass is one of the reasons that we took it off I'm gonna set this up here I'm gonna put a little bit of silicone in the hole to seal the holes up That way, when the screws go in, the screw will actually allow it to push some down in the hole and seal it in the deck. All the way to the oh, there went a fish. We just got a fish, and right in the middle of a self help video, we just got a fish on. And I got a kid with a fish. Okay, let me take this from the eight year old, and she can go reel up her fish. Go, kid, go, 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 go. So, a little bass master over here has been pretty much like racking up all the bass. Come on, get it on. You got to get it out from right the rope. So, you, hey, get it out from right the rope. You're going to lose your fish. Reel, reel it up. Come on, get it up there. He, they're running, they're running, he's running, he's running, he's running. Come on, get it up there. Come on, get it up there, get it up there, get it up there. Nice. All right, come on. Reel him up, reel him up, reel him up, reel him up, reel him up. Reel him up, come on. And we got a nice little bluegill. Okay, so the bass master, oh, my, my personal assistant. Oh, hey, hey, all right. Can you hold him? You got him? Okay, we're gonna let him go, okay? Here, hold the hold the camera for just a second. We'll get him on hook. We'll go back to our video here. Oh, oh. <laughs> come here, come here, come here. I don't wanna hurt him. Poor bass. Oh he's a he's a bluegill baby. A what? Bluegill. He looks like a bass. Okay. So we're Ew. Gonna and we'll get him back over the side. I'll rinse my hands off. Set your pole down. Well, that's okay, the fish that I just caught. All right, let me have that before you drop it in the water. All right, come on. All right, back up to where you were there, kid. Okay, so now we got that back out of the way here. Huh? We just put a little bit of silicone inside the holes. That way we can get the screws to bed down into the compression post. And we're just gonna put a small amount around each one of these. Dad, everybody's gonna see that now. Yeah. The fish all we caught. 
đây a big bloody mess out of this thing. But we want to make sure our screws are definitely sealed. And I have some spider tracks underneath my compression post here. And underneath my mast step. So we're going to add just a little bit of extra silicone around these just to kind of seal them up so they don't get water in the deck. And we'll use a little bit of acetone and a rag to clean off excess. Oops. I can't really talk in the video. Set this in place. So we're going to put these down and set them back into the deck. And then we'll go around, we'll clean up, and we'll wipe everything down with some acetone so we don't have a big bloody mess everywhere. If you set your embeds correctly and you do this, it'll be fairly neat. And you won't have big, ugly amounts of silicone to go wipe up. And clean up. Okay. And after we get all that done, we'll just do a light clean up with some acetone just to kind of get it all off the deck, anything we don't want. sticky it does get messy This mask step will get replaced here in a couple months. Uh, we're going to take it out of the water here short in a couple months here. So we will be replacing the mask step in probably four months, maybe five months. We will be replacing the mask step when the mask comes back down again. Right. I'm not doing it right at the moment. We're uh, refitting everything. I'm going to rebuild the mast, put all new wiring in it, new Windex. Anchor lights, forward lights. And as we get all this all accomplished here, we'll make everything get trimmed out correctly. And I will probably have to readdress some things. Because being on the water, it takes a lot longer to accomplish some of this than it does up on dry land. Alright, 
that's how you put one of these things in. That's pretty much the it.